Hello again. Before I even start anything, let me show you a very quick video. In this video, you are seeing a bio knot being directed through the spinal tissue to the desired target area. And the job for this bio knot is to deliver the medicine into a very specific area within the body. Specific area within the body. It's quite futuristic, not it, and it is no longer in future, it is happening now. Hello everyone, my name is Avkash, and today in a tech startup review session, we are going to review a very promising startup named Bionaut Labs. Are going to review Bionaut in these 10 points, as you could see. We will learn the Bionaut technology, the founders, the problem they are trying to address with their solution, what Bionaut products really look like, how they are positioning themselves, and in which market they are trying to create the solution and how that market really look like, how big it is, what is the growth within that market, etc. At last, we are going to look their business model, their traction, their progress, their overall outlook, and if there are any competition they have, and if they are, then who are their main competitors. You have already seen the video, so let's learn more about Bionaut. Bionauts allow for the targeting of localized diseases with virtually any type of therapeutic. The broader potential for Bionauts extends to many diseases for which traditional therapies prove to be lacking or altogether ineffective. Our business plan is to target debilitating conditions of the central nervous system, such as glioma and Huntington disease. We intend to start from a fully owned in-house program and expand to collaborations along other clinical verticals. A lot of these concepts have been around in science fiction for decades. Now we're making them a reality. So Bionauts are remote controlled micro robot revolutionizing the treatment of central nervous system disorders targeting deep brain structures safely and precisely. So what Bionaut Lab is doing is that they are revolutionizing the treatment of central nervous system disorders with their own precision medicine treatment modality. So by creating a new medical modality of remote controlled micro robots, they call them Bionauts. The Bionaut is trying to transform the way the biopharmaceutical industry develops treatments, allowing them to engineer the therapeutic index for efficiency and maintain safety. They are focused on helping patients suffering from debilitating brain disease who have few available treatment options. The anatomical targeting capabilities of the Bionaut platform makes the new therapeutics technologies such as gene therapy, CRISPR-Cas9, and oncolytic viruses viable in challenging clinical settings. Some of the terms you have listened in this introduction may not be understood to you. However, the work Bionet engineers are trying to bring in the field of medicine and the treatment is quite amazing and futuristic. And that is the excitement behind Bionaut. Bionaut is backed by really great VCs, such as Upfront Ventures, Kosla Ventures, Revolution Ventures, Bold Ventures, Kapor Ventures, and the Edge of Chaos. It means these great folks will not let Bionaut team dry out their resources as long as by not is keep delivering its promises. The Bionaut team is led by three amazing people. The first one is Aviad 
Maisels and he is the executive chairman and the founder and he is also the former CEO and the founder of Prime Sense which is acquired by Apple in past. He is a serial entrepreneur and the visionary behind the Bionaut concept. And the second founder Michael who is also the CEO of Bionaut is a robotics AI expert and his specialty in R&D moonshot projects. He has two decades of experience working in government of Israel and he was also part of Prime Sense which was acquired by Apple. He also worked at McKinsey, Morgan Stanley. So his resume is amazing to be the CEO for a company like Bionaut. Finally, the third founder, Alex, is also part of Prime Sense team. So the all three folks are coming from the same team. So they definitely they have synergy and cohesiveness built into the leadership. Alex is an inventor and he has several patents on his name. Most of the time we wish that we have great leaders, you know, working together with us and we have an opportunity to work with them and assist them. And so I would say that the team at Bionaut would be definitely excited to work with folks like these. Now let's understand the problem Bionaut is trying to address and the solution they are creating to solve this problem. So the patients suffering from debilitating brain diseases have only a few treatment options and with limited impact or results. So conditions like glioma and Parkinson's disease has large unmet medical needs. Medicines comes with side effects due to uncontrolled medicine delivery. Sending medicine through the carriers to the exact location is hard and cumbersome task to solve. And this is what Bionaut vision is. So Bionaut solution is a new direction in precision targeted medicine micro scale robots to deliver biologics or small molecule therapies locally to the targeted disease areas to help patients suffering from severe brain disorder. So Bionaut is a fusion of a platform and a therapeutic into a new modality. We are going to learn more about Bionaut solution in the technology and in the product section. If we try to summarize Bionaut technology in few points, it looks like that. So Bionaut sends robots into the human body to treat diseases. And second, the Bionaut Labs targets disease with remote controlled micro robots. So when you combine these two things, it pretty much tells that what the technology is. But the technology itself is very complex to design, but its, um, its results are amazing. Bionaut have the potential to provide a safer alternative to the interventions designed to treat localized conditions. Their whole technology process is a rigorous preclinical testing program which is establishing the safety of Bionauts and laying the groundwork for the human trial. So technology has already been validated in animals and the human trials are already in process. To maximize the safety in a specific indication, Bionauts are custom designed to have the optimal size, topology and functionality needed to safely navigate to the disease site. So depending on where the Bionauts are going to be applicable in the human body, the size, the topology, as well as the functionality will be designed depending on the need. It means that no one size fits all. Some bionauts may be very small comparative to the others and some will have a little different way to deliver the medicine. It could be medicine, it could be a new cell over there, it could be something which is going to cure that disease. If we look into the Bionaut products, there are two things we can very quickly think of. First one is Bionaut Micro Robot. So just as medicines are designed 
to engage drug targets in a highly selective manner, the bionauts are custom engineered therapeutic micro robots that target payloads to specific locations in the body. So bionauts can be constructed in different versions with custom geometries and surface characteristics. Smaller than a millimeter, they contain moving parts controlled remotely by a compact magnetic controller, allowing them to move slice tissue and release a therapeutic payload from the cargo component. So you can think it's a tiny millimeter size rocket moving in the body and it's controlled by a magnetic controller. So it's a remote control is controlling the movement and the direction where it's ha it has to be placed after completion its journey in the human body. So that's the one product. And the second is Bionaut platform. So the Bionaut platform is a marketplace to develop and manage the pipeline of partnerships, opportunities across multiple high level clinical indications and therapies to advance the technology to patients. So combining the micro robot and the platform, the Bionaut is trying to cure the diseases related to human body. So after looking into the technology and product and the problem Bionaut is trying to solve, let's look into the market and their position. Biotech market is about 500 billion, the 495 billion exactly market and the CAGR, the compound annual growth rate is about 9.4%. And the expectation is that by 2030, it could reach $1 trillion market. The key players in this uh, categories are Lineage, Sana, Priavoid, Caribo, and various others. And some of them already have good amount of funding already with them. They already have a revenue driven business also. So definitely, the Bionaut is going to have the tough competition within their category. But I do believe is that having a great team and leadership to execute will be a big difference maker for them. If we give a quick attention to Bionaut business model, we can see that their real business is to use custom therapeutic micro robots as a primary product to use in targeted medicine delivery. So buy not platform, we already talk about it and the growth from the partnerships with the clinical indications and therapies using the buy not platform could be the place where they could really grow and try to target more and more diseases which comes within the criteria to apply these buy nots and deliver the targeted payload of whatever kind it's applicable to. Looking into the competition, I did not get a lot more companies who are building similar product, but I would like to talk about the Sana Biotech. And that company is repairing and controlling genes in cells or replacing missing or damaged cells to solve the underlying cause of many disease. These emerging capabilities is going to create novel medicines that meaningfully improve patient's outcome and SANA is aiming to lead the way. It means they are working in something similar way, but the delivery could be different. So there could be some overlap because knowledge limitation within the engineering part of the technology. So I would prefer not to comment over it. But the SANA biotech is something definitely why or not has to look as a competitor in the same space. And on top of that, the SANA Biotechnology or the SANA Biotech already has significant amount of funding over $700 million. So they do have funds and team to build whatever they would want to. And comparative to SANA Biotech, the current BioNot funding is about $20 million from tier one venture capitalist. So definitely BioNot has what it takes to be successful if they could deliver the product and the technology they are committed to. 
Let's take a look at the Buy Not progress and traction. So in a very recent news, Buy Not Labs and the Candle Therapeutics announced strategic collaboration in precision targeted delivery of oncolytic viral immunotherapies. And in another news, FDA grants humanitarian use device designation to Buy Not Labs for treatment of Dendy Walker syndrome. Just looking these two news, you can understand that the collaboration is on its way and FDA is also start approving the use of Bionaut micro robots to treat diseases within human. So it means that progress is there because the product is there and this traction is there because now the product is being applied where it should be applying to start giving values to its target users. So those two are very significant progress and traction point. Top of that, they already have a series A funding completed, which is over a year. And with these new progresses and tractions, I'm sure that they must be working on the next uh, series definitely for that. So in summary, we can say that their product is ready. They all have already completed the testing on animals. They also have FDA approvals for some of the treatment in human. They already have a robot to treat pediatric neurological disorder. And FDA also approves the local treatment of all malignant gliomas. So Bionaut is no longer a concept. Instead, it's a business and which has started and the Bionaut technology and products have started generating value. At last, let's take the Bionaut outlook. So based on the tech, Bionauts that are engineered as a unique modality of closed loop therapeutics, combining continuous disease monitoring and customized therapeutics delivery, as well as other medical interventions on demand, including localized stimulations, ablation, and microsurgery. So based on their business, significant traction is there through partnership and approvals. Bionaut is backed by great VC team, so money will not be problem if product is working as expected and FDA approvals are keep coming. Finally, based on market, it's a $500 billion market now and in 10 years, supposed to reach a trillion dollar, it means growth is significant and it's now Bionaut leadership and the execution team to execute what they're supposed to do and deliver the results to their target users as well as the investors. If you would have liked this startup review, please subscribe us and let us grow. And we do appreciate your help. That's all my friends. I hope to see you in my next video. If you have enjoyed our content, please like it share it and subscribe it at last please be good and do good thank you